Hello, I hope you are having a beautiful day. We have had some lovely weather here in North Georgia recently, and it's definitely giving the wonderful spring vibes that I know we are all so ready for. As you guys know, now is the time to get to thrifting for your spring decorations. As I'm thrifting, I'm keeping an eye out for things that I can add to our backyard space and garden. For example, birdhouses, wrought iron decorative pieces that I could add to the fence, and even things like wind spinners or just some of those really fun, whimsical type of garden decorations. Thrifting for home decor is always a great idea because you're going to save money on things that you can add to your home to really give your space a nice refresh. Spring is probably the most popular time when people want to have a refresh in their home because you think of spring cleaning. So ridding yourself of any clutter that's going on or some of those things that really just do not spark joy. So adding things in that do make you happy, you're happy and pleased to see every day. These are fabulous things to hunt for at the thrift store. Something funny about recording your shopping experience is that later when you watch what you've recorded, you see some things that you may not have seen while you were there. And I am talking about that little red lantern I love lanterns for spring and summer, even fall. They are great things to have out on a porch or patio and really just give a beautiful addition of light and coziness. How cute are these little metal baskets? These are the kinds of things that you can add some fresh fruit, especially if it's seasonal or if you're into baking bread or baked goods, have on display when you have some guests over. These are the kinds of elements that really give your home such a homey feel and make it very inviting. I really love the way the vendor added some hydrangea flowers along with that. Doesn't that just scream spring and summer? The color yellow is the color associated with optimism and happy feelings. So if you're looking to add some of that into your space, why not go with a cute little lemon salt and pepper set? I've also seen some really awesome picks that you can get from a floral store or any of the craft stores. And of course, you can always go buy some fresh lemons from the grocery store, add them into a basket on your counter, and there's a wonderful way to get that little splash of happy color. While you're thrifting, keep an eye out for vases and glassware that you can add some fresh flowers to because when we're talking about spring and summer, adding in fresh flowers to your space is really going to give you a great feeling and make the space a lot more cheerful. I love it when I see shelves filled to the brim with goodies. I like to get a nice overview and then just dive right into the things that are calling out to me for example, this really awesome vintage tin. I've mentioned it before, but it's something about that old classic advertising that is just so neat. I would love to hear from you. Do you have any Avon, cologne, or perfume bottles? Those bottles are so cool. Anytime I see a neat little bottle and I take a look at the tag, it is 95% of the time an Avon bottle. Aha, we finally found some wind chimes. Such a great decorative item for your outside space and there is nothing more pleasant than sitting outside on a warm, breezy day and hearing the lovely sound of wind chimes. Love this little teapot birdhouse. Gives me very great ideas. There are so many teapots and teacups out there at the thrift stores. That's something that we could try to make as a spring and summer craft. When you're thrift shopping or antique shopping, take a closer look at some brass pieces because if you're looking to get started with adding vintage elements to your home or bringing in some warmth, brass items are a great way to do that. 
if you're interested in switching up or refreshing your space for spring, adding in some artwork is an excellent way to do that. What are some of the spring decorations that you guys are looking for? I am always gravitating towards anything with flowers. How cute are all of the bunnies? That's absolutely something that you're gonna see a lot of in spring. And it always makes me think of these awesome little bunny dolls that my sister and I had when we were younger. And of course, the wonderful story, The Velveteen Rabbit. How many of you guys remember that story? These shelves were filled with vintage goodies. A lot of the things that I don't need right now, but the things that I love to look at. Not really sure where I would put this basket with the seagull picture on it, but someone painted that on there and it was so vibrant and beautiful. Here are some more lemon items, four glasses for $12. Such a cute way to serve some lemonade. Oh my, these were so beautiful. The colors, I think you can tell from the footage, but they were so vibrant and absolutely something that would be gorgeous displayed on a table for spring and summer. Thrifting is so fun because you're always going to find various styles of decorative items. If you're a book lover, the thrift store is a great place to find some really affordable books, but also vintage books that you can use as decorative items too. This booth usually always has something that I find that I want to buy and bring home. And I thought that this was maybe a bread box at first, but getting a closer look at it, I found that it was an antique ash bin from the 1800s. Absolutely something I've never seen before. Gotta love the brass candlesticks. I really love candlesticks of any kind, but for some reason, the brass ones do always just feel so classic. I love the way that the blue and green looks here, along with the white and wooden touches. Everything just feels so cohesive. I really thought that this jewelry box was so pretty, I don't have anywhere to put it right now, but definitely a very unique piece. You've got to love it when thrift stores give you even more incentive to come and shop there. This one does 50% off Fridays, and I believe it's every last Friday of the month. They may do it every Friday, but I'm not sure. What a wonderful way to bring people into the store and have them save some money on great thrifted items. This was such a great floor pillow and for $15, fantastic deal. And that type of style would look really nice in a bohemian design or somebody that just really wants a nice casual atmosphere. Here are some of those pieces I was speaking about before that you can add to your patio or porch or even backyard fence that really just bring in more of the design element and add some interest to your outdoor space. And you never know what you're going to find at the thrift store. Take a look at this interesting piece. That, my friends, is a turtle. Don't you love the way that this green and blue glass looks together? Very much so reminds you of the sea or a fun beach trip. All right, we are wrapping up this thrift trip and I will take you guys home to show you what I bought. This little stool is the perfect addition to my bathroom. I am going to be touching it up and giving it some love. I hope you guys found some inspiration from this trip. Subscribe for more thrifting adventures and I'll see you next time.